Okay, so it's been like two months since I last posted a video. In my first video, I could stand for 10 minutes and walk for 15. Well, I'm happy to say that two months later, I have doubled my walk-in time and tripled my standing time to 30 minutes each. I am finally seeing the fruits of my labor and I couldn't be happier. I'm a business administration student looking to get my associate's degree. Other than that, I also like to entertain, such as modeling, singing, and acting. I said all of that to say this. I was in class recently, and uh, the teacher had us go around and say our names and say something we like to do. The girl sitting next to me said, my name is so-and-so, and I like to cook. It was my turn, and I said, my name is Treese, and I like to model. Do you know that this girl looked me up and down and laughed? I looked around the classroom like, did I just say something funny? And left it at that. I was going to let ignorance be ignorance. So after class, she comes up to me and she says, So, you model? I said, yes, I do. She said, are you signed? Do you have an agency? I said, no, I don't. I'm an amateur model and I'm looking to get signed by an agency. She said, mm, do you have any modeling pictures? I didn't have any on my phone, but I pulled up Facebook on my phone and showed her from there. When she saw my pictures, her eyes popped 50 feet away from her head and her jaw dropped to the floor. For 30 seconds, she stared at my pictures in awe, then turned to me and said, these pictures are beautiful. You know, I've always wanted to model, but I feel like I need to lose some weight. I said, girl, you are beautiful, and there's always plus size mama. She said, you know, I never thought about that. Thanks. And I said, thank you, too, for the compliments, and we went our separate ways. I chose to take the high road in this situation, and I'm glad I did. Because after she laughed at me for saying that I like to model, the not so high road taken side of me said, Bop that Bama in her head. But I took the high road and that's how the situation went down. I'm glad I did take the high road though, because once she saw my pictures, she I saw a different side of her. She was vulnerable, and I saw that she wanted to do what I'm trying to do all along. There's a saying that goes, those that are too weak to follow their own dreams will always try to discourage you from following your own. That sums it up right there. For those of you who are trying to do something that's outside of the box or that's out of the norm, I just want to let you know, keep doing what you're doing, whether people say you shouldn't be doing it or not. You never know. You could inspire someone, and you could prove somebody wrong. And I tend to do just that with all the other haters out there who think that disabled people can't model. Until next time, peace and love and stay positive.